Hello everyone and welcome back to Bioshock Infinite, this time for the DLC Burial at Sea. Episode 1, apparently. Uh, now this is actually something I'm not that familiar with. Although I know we go back to Rapture, I think around the time that Rapture was booming. That's pretty much all I know. Let's start a new game. Hope you enjoy it. And, uh... Yeah, I went for hard last time. Let's just go for medium. Really, I'm here for the story, so, yeah. Right, so how is this going to tie into the events of the main game? Is this like another reality, another part of the multiverse? Ah, <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> 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 oh, look who it is. We're closed. You don't look the sort who can afford to turn down legitimate work. 58, okay. <coughs> What do you want? How about we start with a light? Yeah, we could we could probably do that. Have I got a laser or can I just Yep. Well you gotta name this. Oh I see. Elizabeth. Hmm. Nice to meet you again. You can call me Elizabeth. What can I do for you? There's a girl who needs to be found. Maybe you've seen her. This girl... This girl's dead. You know her. You'll see dozens of her type down by the docks or the slums in Apollo Square. Orphans. All right, Apollo the Square, yeah. charity shut. No place for them. But her you know. As I said, girl's dead. Hmm. Lost. Look, I don't know where you get... Lost me. isn't dead. Name your radar will pay you for this work. You'd do this one gratis, wouldn't you? I don't follow. Something tells me you will. Okay. Ha <laughs> ha! Rapture! Alright. Seems my instincts were correct. Where's Sally? I don't know. But I know someone who does. Follow me. Go on then. It's good to be back. Sander Cohen. Oh man, alright. I'm going to enjoy your boss fight in the first game. Alright, this is kind of cool actually. I mean, we got glimpses of this, but this, girl to this is the first time we're sort of walking around it. Is my business. But I know where to start looking. Right, Something okay. tells me a man with your particular talents could be useful. Oh, Little Wonders educational facility, that's it. It's kind of strange not to see it in ruins. Was it always here? I mean, has Rapture had a redesign for this DLC? I wouldn't be surprised. I don't remember it being out in the open quite like this. What happened to these children? What are they? Where have you been? Whoa. Cabin in Arcadia? That was weird. Little sisters. Atom factories. It's grotesque. It is a little bit strange. Very, very creepy when they all turn to look at you as well. Okay. Compromise? Is that why we came to Rapture? I could come. Do we get access to Vigors or, or Plasmids in this? I, I don't see, an, like, an Eve meter Come or a... Come on, uh... we haven't got all day. <laughs> oh, the Numo. Right, right. <laughs> this is pretty cool. Hey, look at this guy. What do they even look like under those suits? That's a good question. Are they just some kind of machine? That's a new talent. Right. So this might not be the same universe as the one where I come back to kill Sander Cohen, for instance, in Bioshock 1. I think this is just like another alternate reality. But I say you should have we go in here at all? Oh yeah. This is kind of cool, actually, just allowing us to explore. Get on with it. Do you have any idea how valuable my time is? Hang on, what's this? we got an audio lock here, so we're going to find those. Wait, is that Cohen? It is! Ryan's oh. been good to me. One dollar. Few are the patrons who truly understand the struggle of the artist. But even I was a little leery when he shuttered Fontaine's business and sent that bald buck to a grave deep in the briny. But when Ryan buried all of Fontaine's pals in that department store, someone had to find a home for all those freshly minted orphans. 
And if I turned a dollar or two in the process, you can hardly blame me for doing well by doing good. Hmm, nice. Do it. The house stick sees you, he'll toss you out on your ass again. Oh yeah? I've got a reputation around here. Hmm, okay. Missing girls. Nerve showing your face around here, pal. I know. Can I get past though? No, apparently not. And I can't jump over either, so alright, well, this is obviously not where we're meant to be. It's over there? Funny. What? You're not knowing about the little sisters. How long have you been in Rapture? Let's just say I don't get out much. You've got eyes and ears, don't you? If I wanted to share my life story, Mr. DeWitt, I would write my memoirs. Hmm. If I learned anything about Rapture, I thought it was a place where people understood to mind their own business. Where are we headed? The man we need to see is in the Garden of the Muses. How do you know? My sources are my own, Mr. DeWitt. If you have better information as to the whereabouts of your girl, I suggest you avail yourself of it. All right, fair enough. Well, she's obviously taking the lead. Let's just uh, let's go to this Garden of the Muses. I don't remember that from the, uh, the first two games. Where are you taking me? When's the last time you saw Sally? What? She was taken from you, wasn't she? How do you know this? She was taken <laughs> down at Surprise. That Surprise. She disappeared. And a cop friend of mine, Sullivan. Says they found her floating in the docks. You see the body? Look. Did you see the body? This world values children, not childhood. There's a profit to be made and men who make it. I'm taking you to one of them. Oh, oh boy. Mr. DeWitt, you alright? I'm fine. No, I'm not. Just get these spells sometimes. It'll pass. What was that? Refreshment, oh. sir. Madam? Just for a moment, I thought you might be Mr. Lutet. Lutez. Oh, right, that's pretty nifty. I suppose you never have to walk again. <laughs> as long as you've got a big supply of Eve. Nice. Right, lead the way. Where, where are we going? Do we still have, like, the, um... Okay, yeah, we've still got the, the end, so we still get the arrow on the floor. <laughs> complete one-man show, and he's got everything taken care of, it looks like. So, this way, is it? Lost and found. Anything for me? Oh, maybe. <laughs> Another dollar. Just the one. But it all comes in handy, I'm sure. Elizabeth, where are we going? This way? I mean, I am meant to be following you, right? Mr. DeWitt. Oh, Cohen, right. What? We'll find my source inside of that club. Cohen. This one? What does that lunatic have to do with Sally? This is quite nice, actually. A sort of callback to the first game. Yeah. Maybe some of these guys are the ones I kill later on. Uh, like, I guess a couple of years from now, right? Yeah. Which business do you represent, sir? Uh... Business? Yes, which business? DeWitt Investigations. Mr. Cohen does not truck with private detectives. Ah. Masks of invitation went to artists and craftsmen alone. I'm with the Masks? artist struggle. Okay. We're expected. No mask, no entry. Stuffed shirt. These mm. invitation masks he spoke of. They must have gone out to local artisans. Well, I guess we'll have to persuade someone to loan us one. The business of rapture is business. <laughs> Says it's very convenient. By the artist struggle, the Golden Rule, and Rapture Records. I guess those stores would be as good a place to start as any. All right. Yeah. Private. Three local stores that might have received invitations to Cohen's Club. You can choose your current objective from the objective screen. Fair enough. Okay. And that's going to be the objective screen that I very rarely look at. And that's going to be. Yeah. Okay. Cool. All right, well, uh, the golden rule, I think I saw, actually, over there. Where was it? This one? The g yeah, the golden rule. Let's try that. What brought you to Rapture? A man. Really? You don't strike me as the romantic type. Wasn't that kind of man. Then what? There's a debt that needs repaying. <laughs> I've known my Sounds share familiar. of Shylocks. You're no Shylock. Wasn't that kind of debt. The golden rule, then. Yeah. Invitations to Cohen shows are highly coveted. Nobody's gonna just hand us one. You think you can figure out a way to distract the store owner while I take a look around? You just find the mask. 
Leave the distractions to me. Okay. Sounds good. Good day to you, sir. Uh, and to you. Presumably I'm not going to have to blow your brains out. Alright. Okay. So, what do we do here? <laughs> I'm not hopping over. Can I? Oh, I can speak with you. Great. Excuse me. Lady has some questions for you. Yes, of course. I'm interested in this piece. Ah, excellent. You've an eye, haven't you, miss? It's a natural sapphire and diamond, 18 karat gold ring. Oh, I see. For Paris, 1887. That's a lot of fine talk about a stolen ring. I beg your pardon? Right out of her coffin in Twilight Fields. Perfect. Did you think we wouldn't <laughs> She's know? pretty good, isn't she? Okay. The assurances of a grave robber are of no interest to me. Come on, I've got to have more than two dollars at some point, right? I've got a box. Ah, look at this. Ah, it's not in there. Somewhere else. Okay. I'll still grab the money, because why not? Ring? Ooh. What's going on? What? What the fuck did you just do? Best if we were gone when he wakes up. Any luck? Nothing. <laughs> Alright. Let's find another shop. Who needs Where guns when you've got next? Elizabeth, right? Upstairs at the artist's struggle or rapture record straight ahead. Upstairs or straight ahead? I guess straight ahead. Or through here? I guess it's gotta be through here somewhere. Well, that's where we came from, so. Rapture Records. Yeah, okay. Again, a name that's familiar to me, and it probably somewhere we explored in one of the first two games. But if if so, it probably wasn't here. Or it looked somewhat different. Anyway, yeah, let's let's go in. Welcome, welcome. Nice. You wouldn't happen to have a mask around here, would you? You see that dish I walked in with? Will you give her the star treatment, pal? That'll make it worth your while. Of course, right away. Oh, there she is. Same sort of thing. Is <laughs> I guess. It's by Trine, but of course, covered by Mr. Reinhardt. Nice. It's lovely. Isn't it lovely? Oh. Uh, let's just go this way, I suppose. Find that ah, there you go. Nothing. <laughs> Typical. Only one place left. Well, I guess, but yeah, I've still got time. I just wanted to see what else I can steal. Is there anything else I can steal? That... Oh, really? <laughs> Probably not very good. Probably going to lure him over here. What's in the case? Nothing. Come on. So, what happened to the mask, exactly? It's, it's just hidden, or did they send out empty boxes occasionally? Right. Well, it, it's not here, so it must be in the other place. I must go. I must go. Even one more note shall prove my undoing. <laughs> She's a pretty good actress, I guess. Got one place left, though. And if that means to be fruitless, we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. Right, so it was upstairs you mentioned, yeah? Maison, <laughs> Maison Vosges, or something like that. Can we go in here as well? Yeah. Hey. Maybe they misdelivered the mask. Can I? Bonjour, Signor. <laughs> hey, come and stay. One. Anyway, we might not find a mask in here, but I'm sure there's going to be something around here I can steal. Hmm, well, somewhere. God oh, damn. Well, at least there's an audio log to steal. Su Chong, Su ah. Chong observe strangest of coincidences. On the other side of a window, man in strange hat experimenting on Su Chong's own creation. On plasmid. Man name of Fink. Outrage! Depth of intellectual property! Hmm. But man name of a thing is no fool. Through addition of oxidizing agent, turns plasmid ingestible through stomach lining. Mr. Ryan very impressed with Su Chong's initiative. Theft of intellectual property. Two-way street. Oh, that's pretty interesting, actually. So there's Fink and Su Chong. So there's Vigors and plasmids as well and I've been you know picking stuff up that do like plus and minus Eve so I guess we are going to get some powers at some point if I just 
Yeah, if I hold Q right now, I don't get the wheel up, so we haven't got anything. But anyway, yeah, um, need to know theatre. Let's let's take a look, shall we? Oh, is that oh so familiar music in the background? That's great. Are you in the know? Not right now. You've doubtlessly sampled products from Fontaine Futuristics. But do you know why Ryan Industries saved it? Frank Fontaine, business leader and benefactor of mankind? Or was he the best friend the parasite ever had? Were you aware his businesses were a front for a smuggling ring? And were you also fooled by his supposed charity work? At his free clinic, patients <laughs> became test subjects. And his orphanages were places that children disappeared into and never came out. Once they learned the truth, Rapture's Central Council called for the arrest of Fontaine Futuristic's owner. But, a coward to the end, Fontaine found a hail of bullets preferable to facing justice. Or did he? The council asked that Ryan Industries assume the burden of stewardship of Fontaine's ill-gotten assets. And Andrew Ryan accepted that burden for the people of Rapture. Now all citizens can enjoy these products, free of criminal taint. Nice. Now you know. I guess now I do. Some of that didn't sound completely correct, but maybe in this universe that's actually what happens. I'm not really sure. I don't know if there's going to be any wild differences, but let's see. Anything? Come on, 777. Ah, oh, man. Oh, I still got something, though. Best to quit while you're ahead. You're probably right, actually. Anyway, the artist's struggle, hopefully where I'm going to find the mask, is just over there. So let's go check it out, shall we? All that unpleasantness with Fontaine seems so far. Right. Very nice. Very... Very nice, yeah. Well, I'm not so sure about that one, to be honest. What the fuck? Interesting pieces. Wonderful to see you. Same to you. Nice haircut. Hey, pal. You want to help out the little lady? Yes, of course. Interesting, isn't it? An original Sander Cohen. Oh, really? He calls it miasma. I bet he does. I'm sorry, but I, here we I go. Know precious little about art. How does it make you feel? I don't want to open my mouth for fear of what fools. I don't know. Another safe, maybe? Is that it? Well, there's a safe, but... There it is! And there's a mask! We've actually got one! Right! Don't we need two? I guess not. I guess one's enough. Can't seem to see anything in the safe, so, uh... Is that all we're gonna find back here? Whiskey? Okay, well, yeah, sure. Oh, boy. Oh yeah, probably not the best idea to get drunk right now. So much to think about. I, I feel a trifle swoony. Oh. Would, would you mind if, if I return tomorrow for further education? I shall be here at your service until tomorrow. All right, perfect. And he's none the wiser, somehow, as I stumble past him. Good. You've located the mask. I did. Time to chart. All right. It's best we head back to Cohen's. Probably. It's neat. Yeah, okay. Fine piece of work back with those shopkeeps. Yeah. You've got a bit of the grifter in you. For that, you can thank my father. Oh, yeah? He was a man comfortable in a variety of roles. Is that right? Mr. DeWitt, back again. Oh. So I have a reputation here as well? So soon, eh? Oh. What's my bottle of choice? I'll probably take the shelf, to be honest. Right, again, uh, it looks like I need to know something. So, what do I need to know about? So, oh, what kind of you in? Yeah, you know, occupation. Can't imagine. We'll get back to that, I guess. Are you in the know? Innovation and competition are what fuel rapture. But that fuel can be diluted with rumor or flat out lies. The rumor monger asks What are these so called splicing side effects? Well, take a look around you. Do you see anything wrong with your neighbor? Not yet. The rumor monger asks, Why has Tenenbaum withdrawn from the public's eye? Dr. Tenenbaum is a scientific mind unparalleled, even in rapture. She's no doubt in her lab, toiling away at her next great innovation. I heard she was in cahoots with Fontaine. Merely slander from jealous naysayers. Remember, rapture competes through innovation. 
not cheap shots. Bridget <laughs> Tenenbaum is a woman who represents the best of science and industry. In other words, she's a rapture gal. Now you know. Now I do. And everyone wants to be a rapture gal, don't they? So, yeah. Cool. Kind of employment would lead you to tag along on a job like this. I suppose you could say I work in debt collection. <laughs> Anything around here? I, I take it if I like drink the wine, they're gonna throw me out or something. But I kind of want to sample the goods, you know. So. No one cared. Now I'm just gonna eat some cheese as well. No. Can I go a bit ridiculous? Oh, I am paying for them. <laughs> I'll have to shoot. Damn. All right. Spoiler. Right. Where's Where's that Cohen guy? I think I want to pick a fight with him. The great chain guides all of our efforts. <laughs> Honestly, it's good to be back. I'm really, really glad they uh, they released this DLC. This better work. Otherwise, we'll certainly look the fools. Trust me. <laughs> Trust me, as I say, as I slur through my words. Uh, I well, I guess let's enter the club. I think we've looked around enough. The mask goes on. Ah, very well. Mr. Cohen awaits your participation at his performance. All right, I guess that was a good disguise. Talk to the guy, okay. So who is this fellow Cohen? Some sort of underworld figure? Why is it so bloody bright? He's an artist. An artist who kidnaps children. Cohen's muse is a bit more diverse. I've seen this type. Gets an idea in his head, end a conversation. Don't matter who gets hurt. Okay. You first, Elizabeth. <laughs> I don't really like the idea of this. <laughs> Shit. That got me. I have to say, I've missed that sound. It's one of those strange things. Dance, dance, move. That's the guy. Right. Okay. Uh, what? What was he? He was. He was like a version of a Houdini splicer, wasn't he? In the first game. Be the Guess he's down there somewhere. Open yourselves to the music. Oh yes. Yeah. Spirit of the <laughs> This. No. Why do you fail in this fashion? Oh dear. To embarrass me in front of my muse. My muse shall not be mocked. This way. Prince Patrick! Please! The stick! Oh. for God's sake! Ah! No. My muse shall not be mocked! Get them okay, out here! Now. There shall be no failure on my canvas. <laughs> Bring in the next two. For the artist. Yeah, let's speak to Cohen. Who are you? Name's DeWitt. Is that right? My. <laughs> this one's a real biscuit. Isn't he a biscuit, lady? I need to ask you a few questions. Questions? Yes. Yes. It is the work of man to ask. It is the work of the artist to answer. You've seen this girl, haven't you? We artists see more than most. Is that a yes? You are more than you claim to be, little songbird. <laughs> Why would you go and call Watch her that? Watch this one, DeWitt. She'll take you where you don't want to go. I believe you. But I know the child in that photo is important to you. So many children flit, flit, flit away. I know where the girl is. And I will send you to her in exchange. All I have. Is a dance. A dance. A dance. What? A dance. I see something in you too. Art strips away artifice. Show me who you are, and I will show you where you need to go. Cold, son of a bitch. Mr. Dewey. What? A dance. A dance. A dance. A dance. A dance. A dance. 
Okay. Come, come, All right. dance. Well, I mean, at least we're not sort of hooked up like they were, and they still haven't been pulled to the top. Feel the oh, boy. Feel the music. Here we go, then. Let's not let him down. I shudder to think what greater price he might care to extract. Fitzpatrick! Beauty and pain. They can be no more separated than birth and blood. What do you think Cohen's customers do with the children? Do they? Sometimes. But those types like the capital of people like Ryan and Suchon. That's a blessing. You saw those little sisters? You so sure? But if Su Chong had Sally, I'd know it. How? As I tied him to a chair and asked him. So? For 15 hours. Oh. <laughs> I don't know what to make of you, Mr. DeWitt. No, 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 no! Listen, we're not gonna keep- Fitzpatrick! Wait. Oh. It must be- Alright, I thought it was the ropes, I guess it's the floor. Shit. I see suffering in you. I know how to shine the light on your pain. A more will become a butterfly. Why do I have a feeling that that painting's going to end up like another miasma, or whatever it was called? <laughs> Where have you been? Whoa. Cabin in Arcadia? That's a new talent. Madam? Just for a moment, I thought you might be Mr. Lute Lutez. Fine talk about a stolen ring. Ring? Oh. What's going on? What? What the fuck did you just do? Oh, is that oh so familiar music in the background? That's great. Oh, I am paying for them. <laughs> I'll have to shoot? Damn, alright. Spoiler. Shit. That got me. 